Distributing the COVID-19 vaccine is just critical to fighting the coronavirus, but just as important, talking over the questions that might be on your mind and any lingering doubts for people who do have doubts. On your side's Brianna Ray Turner joins us now from Baptist Hospital, where local doctors are putting their minds towards myth busting tonight. Hey, Brianna. Yes, good evening. Yeah, many, people's have, many people have concern about the vaccine, but doctors here at Baptist Health are here to put your mind at ease. Myths that doctors at Baptist Health hear quite often that they like to clarify for the public. The first myth being the COVID-19 vaccine can give you COVID-19. You can't get COVID-19 from the vaccine. Um, the vaccine is, it doesn't have the virus in it. It has um, a messenger RNA which is a type of genetic material that produces the spike protein that your body develops resistance to. That brings us to our second myth. The COVID-19 vaccine has harmful ingredients. There's always a concern that there, there might be mercury. You know, that was a, a concern about vaccines from a long time ago and other sorts of harmful substances. And it's just not true. The third most heard concern is that the vaccines were rushed. Dr. Ransom, executive vice president and chief physician executive at Baptist Health, says she understands the raised eyebrows, but this process was done efficiently and safely. No corners in safety were taken. In fact, um, this was a large, a large study. 44,000 people participated in this in this study. Um, so the safety profile is really good. Another way Ransom says researchers were able to speed up the process was because there had been work already looking at messenger RNA vaccines. The last myth being the COVID-19 vaccines could give you dangerous side effects. They're similar to side effects you get from other vaccines. The most common is that there is sensitivity at the injection site and in your arm. Um, most people have a little bit of that. Ransom says it appears the second dose of the vaccine could cause you to be fatigued, have muscle aches or headaches. Now, doctor, still want to remind you that just because the vaccine's out doesn't mean you stop following all the safety protocols. I'm live in Jacksonville, Brianna Ray Turner, First Coast News on your side.